the 2025 GMC Arcadia bigger, better and more expensive. Hey everyone, today we are diving into the revamped 2025 GMC Arcadia SUV which was received a major makeover. This new model is not only longer, wider and taller but it also comes with a hefty price tag starting at $42,600, about $5,800 more than the previous version. While GMC hasn't officially announced the price hike yet, we expect the details to drop any day now. So what's new with the Acadia? To justify the price bump, GMC has reshuffled the trim levels. The base SLD trim now comes packed with features that were previously only available in the elevation package of the SLT trim. This means more bang for your buck right from the get-go. Every 2025 Acadia now sports an impressive 11.0-inch digital gauge cluster and a gigantic 15.0-inch touchscreen which runs on Google infotainment system. It also supports wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, so you can stay connected without the hassle of cables. Standard features include heated front seats, a heated steering wheel, remote start, satellite radio, USB ports in every row, and a power tailgate. When it comes to safety, GMC has set, stepped up in its game. The 2025 Acadia now includes a suit of driver's assist features such as automatic emergency braking, blind spot monitoring, adaptive cruise control, automatic high beams and rear seat reminder to keep everyone safe. Under the hood, GMC has swapped out the old engine for a new 2.5 litre turbo charged 4 cylinder engine. This new engine boosts power and torque enhancing the towing capacity from 4000 to 5000 pounds. It might also offer better fuel efficiency but we'll have to wait for the official figures. For those seeking a torch of luxury, the Acadia Denali trim starting at $54,300 delivers even more premium features. On the other hand, if you are an off-road enthusiast, check out the Acadia 8T4 trim. It's equipped with off-road tires, tow hooks and specially tuned suspension to handle rough terrains. Overall, the 2025 GMC Acadia is aiming high the premium SUV segment going head to head with rivals like the Mazda CX-90, Lincoln Aviator and Toyota Grand Highland.